I'm Bradley Hasemeyer, and if you are watching this video, it's because you probably want to find the best sports sedan for your money. Makes sense. So today, I'm doing a comparison for the totally redesigned Acura TLX and the Audi A4 to find out which one of these deserves a spot in your driveway. Now the A4, it's a pretty good looking car. Over the past couple of years, they have updated the front and the rear of the vehicle to try to make it a little bit more modern. I do like the honeycomb grill on the 45 TFSI model and the grooved hood slits are kind of cool too. Plus now LEDs are standard across all trims, but despite all these changes, I would say the A4 is still kind of that safe and conservative style that we've come to know from Audi. On the interior of the A4, you'll find a clean and modern cabin with a little touch of technology, which I like. These eight-way power adjustable seats are comfortable, but still firm, which is a nice combination. You do get standard heated seats, but you have to upgrade to the Premium Plus or Prestige packages if you want memory settings. On the inside, you'll definitely notice the new touchscreen display. I really like it, but I feel like there's gonna be a bunch of fingerprints after a little bit. Also standard, you do get Apple CarPlay and Android Auto integration, both a major plus. And when it comes to safety and driver assistance features, well, the Audi offers a few that are really helpful, but to get things like adaptive cruise control or lane keeping assist, you have to upgrade to the more costly driver assistance package. All right, now this is what a sports sedan should look like. This is the all new Acura TLX. It's been totally reimagined from the ground up, starting with the chassis and just wow. Now, right off the bat, you're gonna notice this car is lower and wider. It gives it more of that athletic and aggressive stance. Also Acura lengthened the TLX. And from the side profile, you can really see that muscular hood and how the cabin's been pulled back to give the car more of a sporty coupe-like appearance. And it's sitting on larger alloy wheels. Now the styling of this new TLX really kicks off up front with that chiseled hood. You of course have the diamond pentagon grille, the four lamp jewel eye LED headlights with new chicane daytime running lights, which look really cool. Then you've got the character lines that flow out of that and go all the way to the back to those muscular rear shoulders. In the back, you also have chicane LED taillights, which match the style from up front, and those dual exhaust outlets. Oh, and we're just getting started. Let me show you how Acura has carried this sporty style to the interior. Welcome inside the completely redesigned Acura TLX. Impressive, right? It's premium, it's tech savvy, and the interior is really designed around the driver and the front seat passenger. So you've got this wide and high center console. You've got the wraparound instrument panel. It creates this defined space for both of the front seat occupants. Plus, not to mention, the car is now wider, which gives you more hip, elbow, and shoulder room. And I really like what Acura's done on the inside here. Everything's exactly where you want it to be, starting with this really nice leather-wrapped steering wheel, and of course, paddle shifters right at your fingertips, giving you ultimate control. They have these heated leather sport seats, which are very comfortable and can be power adjusted up to 16 ways. They can also come with ventilation, and I don't know if you noticed this, but the contrast stitching and the piping on the seats really elevates the look of this. And there's plenty of useful space inside the center console, including two convenient USB ports, one for charging and one you can integrate with your Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Standard, by the way, across all TLX trims. Oh, and speaking of phones, on some trims, you can use the wireless charger. And there's all kinds of other available tech as well, like a head-up display, a surround view camera, blind spot information system, and much more. And one of the things I really love from this interior here is the 10-inch display. It's beautiful, it's sharp, it's crisp, and it integrates with what I call the brilliant true touchpad interface, which is really easy to use, which essentially means whatever you touch on the touchpad corresponds to the area on the screen. There's no fumbling around, learning a jog dial or a mouse or a scroll wheel. No, it's simple and it's smart. And if you're an audiophile, good news, you can now opt for the ELS Studio 3D Premium Audio System, which comes with 17 speakers throughout the car, including the ceiling, for a truly immersive experience, almost like you're in a music studio. And the immersion doesn't stop there, no. One of the coolest features on this new TLX is the available customizable cabin lighting system with up to 27 different themes. You can even pair it with your different drive modes for a truly immersive driving experience. All right, so I know what you're wondering, what's under the hood? Well, I'm glad you asked. The new TLX comes with a new 272 horsepower VTEC turbo engine. It's very smooth and very quick. 
They're pairing it with a 10-speed automatic transmission and giving you paddle shifters on the inside so you are in charge of how much fun you want to have. The new TLX is a premium sports sedan right down to its bones. It's been completely reimagined from the ground up on the most rigid body structure Acura's ever made, aside from that on the NSX supercar. That rigid structure, combined with the new front double wishbone suspension, means steering feel and cornering grip go to the next level. And, of course, when it's time to slow your roll, as it were, Acura has used a new electric servo braking system to give you incredibly responsive stopping power. And for the ultimate in control, the TLX offers available super handling all-wheel drive with industry-leading torque vectoring. That essentially means that the system distributes power from the front wheels to the back and also to the left and to the right, which gives you sharper and more accurate turn-in and improved traceability when cornering. Now, whether you opt for the front-wheel drive or the super handling all-wheel drive, you can always switch through your different drive modes on the fly. That'll make some big changes to the available adaptive dampers, the throttle, the transmission, the steering, even the interior lighting system if you opt for it. And we're not talking about subtle tweaks like on some brands. It's essentially like having the keys to three different cars. You could even set up your own settings and launch your individual drive mode at the push of a button. And of course, there's also safety and driver assistance features to talk about. And Acura doesn't make you upgrade to some expensive special safety package. No, it's called Acura Watch, and it includes collision mitigation braking, lane keeping assist, road departure mitigation, adaptive cruise control, traffic jam assist, and a whole lot more, and it's standard across all TLX trims. With most competitors, you're looking at paying thousands of dollars more for that tech. Now, when it comes to the performance, the A4 does pretty well. It is an Audi after all. Like the TLX, it also has a two liter turbocharged engine and they both handle really nicely, but that's where the similarities end. The Audi has less horsepower and less torque than the TLX, not to mention it's got only a seven speed transmission versus a 10 speed in the Acura. And let's say you even upgraded to the 45 TFSI model with Quattro all wheel drive the performance still falls short. All right, it's time. Who comes out on top? Well, I don't know about you, but for me, it's pretty easy. The A4 looks good, but it's still a little bit conservative. When it comes to the Acura, it's got aggressive styling front to back that I really love. And when it comes to that overall spirited performance, sorry, the Audi just kind of falls short. And if we're talking overall value, that's not even close. Roll the chart. <laughs> So the new TLX speaks for itself. I mean, it's been completely reimagined with a fresh and athletic new look. I think Acura really nailed the interior and exterior design on this one. Plus, it's the quickest and best handling sports sedan Acura's ever made. And it comes loaded with a ton of great features just built right in. Talk about a clear winner, but hey, that's just what I think. You have to make your own decision. Head to Acura.com to learn more.